Did you know that black holes are one of the most fascinating and mysterious phenomena in the universe? Today, we'll take you on a mind-blowing journey as we unveil the top 10 black holes in the universe. So, sit back, relax, and get ready to explore the enigmatic depths. Number 10, Cygnus X1. Cygnus X1 is not just a black hole, it's a symbol of human perseverance and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. Found within the wings of the constellation Cygnus, this X-ray binary star system has played an instrumental role in our understanding of black holes. Cygnus X1 was identified in the 1960s during X-ray sky surveys. This was groundbreaking, as black holes were primarily theoretical objects at the time, and observational evidence was scarce. The system, Cygnus X1 is an X-ray binary consisting of a massive star and a black hole. The intense gravitational pull of the black hole draws material from its companion star. The black hole in Cygnus X1 has an estimated mass of about 15 solar masses, placing it in the category of stellar mass black holes. These black holes are formed when massive stars exhaust their nuclear fuel and undergo supernova explosions, leaving behind a core that collapses to become a black hole. Its eventual identification as a black hole marked a watershed moment in astrophysics. With the advancement of astronomical technology, Cygnus X1 continues to be a subject of study. The study of Cygnus X1 has opened the door to identifying and understanding numerous other black hole systems in our universe. As we delve deeper into the cosmos, systems like Cygnus X1 serve as both guideposts and reminders of the mysteries that await our discovery. Number 9, GW 150914. In the serene tapestry of the cosmos, even the most violent events can sometimes go unnoticed, their signatures too faint for electromagnetic telescopes. Gravitational waves, as predicted by Albert Einstein's general theory of relativity in 1915, are distortions or ripples in the fabric of spacetime caused by some of the most violent and energetic processes in the universe. Despite the theory's prediction, it took a full century before we had the technological prowess to detect them. On September 14, 2015, the Twin Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory LIGO, detectors, located in Louisiana and Washington in the U.S., made the first-ever direct observation of gravitational waves. This event, designated GW 150914, was the result of the collision of two black holes. The detected gravitational waves originated from two black holes, roughly 29 and 36 solar masses, merging to form a single black hole of about 62 solar masses. The energy equivalent of about three solar masses was emitted as gravitational waves during the merger, producing the signal that LIGO detected. It not only confirmed Einstein's prediction but also inaugurated a new era in astronomy, gravitational wave astronomy. Post GW 150914, several other gravitational wave events have been detected, many of them also stemming from black hole mergers. These detections have provided a wealth of information about black hole properties, their distributions, and the dynamics of their mergers. The continued study of gravitational waves promises to unveil secrets about neutron star collisions, the early moments of the universe, and other cosmic phenomena. In a universe brimming with wonders, GW 150914 stands as a testament to our quest to understand the cosmos. Number 8, Sagittarius A. Nestled in the vibrant constellation of Sagittarius, approximately 26,000 light-years from Earth, lies an astronomical enigma that holds the key to many of the mysteries of our galaxy, Sagittarius A. The existence of an intense radio source in the direction of the Sagittarius constellation was identified in the 1970s. This compact radio source has since been identified as the supermassive black hole at the center of our Milky Way galaxy. Sagittarius A is not your ordinary black hole. It's a supermassive one, possessing an estimated mass of around 4.3 million solar masses. Over the years, sophisticated instruments have tracked the motion of stars near Sagittarius A. While Sagittarius A was not the first black hole to be directly imaged, that honor goes to M87, efforts have been made by the EHT to capture its image as well. Its proximity and significance make it a prime candidate for future direct imaging, promising more detailed observations. The presence of Sagittarius offers clues about the evolution of the Milky Way, Supermassive black holes are believed to play a crucial role in the formation and growth of galaxies, making our understanding of Sagittarius a pivotal in piecing together the cosmic jigsaw of our galaxy's history. Number 7, V404 Cygni. V404 Cygni was first identified in 1989 when it erupted in a burst of X-rays and gamma rays. V404 Cygni is a binary system consisting of a black hole and a sun-like star. 
The black hole, with an estimated mass of about nine solar masses, is in a close orbit with its companion star, siphoning off its material. Unlike many black hole systems that exhibit somewhat predictable outbursts, V404 Cygni can remain dormant for years and then suddenly become one of the brightest sources in the X-ray sky. Jets and Dynamics During its active periods, V404 Cygni has been observed to shoot out relativistic jets, streams of particles accelerated to near the speed of light. Intriguingly, these jets can change direction over a matter of minutes, a behavior not typically seen in black hole systems. Scientific Contributions The unpredictable nature of V404 Cygni has made it a subject of intense study. Despite the wealth of data and numerous observations, V404 Cygni remains somewhat enigmatic. In the vast expanse of the universe, V404 Cygni stands out as a beacon of unpredictability and wonder. Number 6, GRS 1915 plus 105. Amidst the vastness of space, certain celestial objects defy our understanding and challenge the paradigms of astrophysics. One such object is GRS 1915 plus 105, a microquasar that has become a centerpiece of study for those keen on unlocking the secrets of black hole dynamics. GRS 1915 plus 105 was first detected in 1992 through its X-ray emissions. What makes this object particularly notable is the extreme variability of its X-ray emissions, which can change dramatically over mere seconds. Microquasar Classification A microquasar is a smaller cousin of the more massive quasars found at the centers of galaxies. GRS 1915 plus 105 has earned this classification due to the relativistic jets it emits. These jets, composed of matter accelerated to near the speed of light, are reminiscent of the massive jets produced by supermassive black holes in quasars. GRS 1915 plus 105 is not a lone object but rather part of a binary system. It consists of a black hole and a companion star. The black hole, which is estimated to be around 14 solar masses, is voraciously consuming material from its companion, leading to the dynamic and unpredictable X-ray emissions observed. In 1994, it became the first stellar mass black hole from which relativistic jets were observed. These jets provide crucial insights into the processes near the event horizon of black holes and the mechanisms by which energy and matter can be ejected at significant fractions of the speed of light. The environment around the black hole in GRS 1915 plus 105 is in a constant state of flux. The material from the companion star forms an accretion disk around the black hole. This has made GRS 1915 plus 105 an excellent laboratory for studying accretion processes. GRS 1915 plus 105 challenges many of our conventional understandings about black hole accretion and jet formation. The lessons learned from this system have implications for larger systems, including active galactic nuclei and the supermassive black holes at the centers of galaxies. Number 5, Cygnus X1. Cygnus X1 is a name that resonates deeply within the annals of astrophysics, acting as a cornerstone for our understanding of stellar mass black holes. Detected in the early 1960s by X-ray instruments aboard suborbital rockets, Cygnus X1 stood out as a potent X-ray source in the constellation Cygnus. Subsequent observations in the late 1960s and 1970s provided compelling evidence that Cygnus X1 was a binary system containing a black hole, marking it as one of the first strong candidates for a stellar mass black hole. At the heart of Cygnus X1 lies a captivating cosmic dance between a massive blue supergiant star, HDE 226868, and a black hole. The black hole, with an estimated mass of about 15 solar masses, pulls material from the supergiant. Observations indicated that the compact object in the binary system was too massive to be a neutron star but was also confined within a small enough volume that it couldn't be anything but a black hole. These observations played a pivotal role in the scientific community's acceptance of the existence of black holes. The intense X-ray emissions from Cygnus X1 arise due to the extreme temperatures in the accretion disk, where material spirals inwards at high velocities. The gravitational energy converts into heat, causing the disk to glow brightly in X-rays. Observations of these emissions have offered valuable insights into the physics of extreme gravitational fields. The song narrates a tale of a spaceship's journey towards the black hole, symbolizing the inexorable pull of the unknown. Even today, Cygnus X1 remains a vital observational target. As instruments become more advanced, scientists continue to probe its environment, seeking a deeper understanding of black hole dynamics, accretion processes, and high-energy astrophysics. Cygnus X1's story is not just one of a black hole but also of humanity's insatiable curiosity. Its discovery and subsequent studies exemplify our quest to understand the universe's enigmatic entities. In the tapestry of cosmic exploration, 
Cygnus X1 shines brightly, both as a beacon of knowledge and as a testament to the wonders that await beyond the known. Number 4, M87. Nestled within the Virgo constellation, amidst a galaxy teeming with stars and interstellar material, lies M87, a supermassive black hole that has captured the imagination of both the scientific community and the public. M87, also known as Virgo A, is a giant elliptical galaxy in the Virgo cluster. It's distinguished by a conspicuous jet of energetic plasma that can be observed from Earth in the radio wavelength, indicating the presence of a powerful central object. M87 is one of the most massive black holes known to us. Precise measurements have been challenging, but estimates suggest its mass is around 6.5 billion times that of our Sun. This is considerably more massive than the black hole at the center of our Milky Way, Sagittarius A. In April 2019, the world was introduced to the first ever image of a black hole's event horizon, courtesy of the Event Horizon Telescope EHT, collaboration. This image wasn't of any ordinary black hole but of M87. The dark silhouette, surrounded by a bright emission ring, was a visual confirmation of theoretical predictions and a monumental achievement in observational astrophysics. The significance of the image, the EHT's observation of M87 provided invaluable empirical evidence for the existence of black holes, validating several predictions of Einstein's general relativity. The shadow cast by the event horizon and the glowing gas around it matched remarkably well with theoretical models. The aforementioned jet, which extends about 5,000 light-years from the galaxy's core, is believed to be powered by the black hole, although the exact mechanisms are still a topic of research. This jet provides crucial insights into the interactions between supermassive black holes and their surrounding environments. It offers opportunities to probe the very nature of space-time and further our understanding of fundamental physics. M87 is more than just a black hole, it's a testament to the power of collaborative science and the endless wonders of the universe. Observations of this colossal entity don't just satiate our cosmic curiosity but also pave the way for deeper, more profound questions about the nature of the universe and our place within it. Number 3, NGC 4998. Resting approximately 308 million light-years away in the Coma Berenices constellation is the elliptical galaxy NGC 4889, one of the brightest and largest members of the Coma Cluster. At its core resides an awe-inspiring supermassive black hole, challenging our perceptions of scale and cosmic gravity. The Coma Cluster's luminary, the Coma Cluster, comprising over 1,000 identified galaxies, is one of the richest galaxy clusters known. NGC 4889 stands as one of its brightest beacons. The sheer size and luminosity of this galaxy hint at the titanic forces at play within its core. The black hole at the heart of NGC 4889 is nothing short of monstrous. Based on stellar velocity dispersions and other observational data, estimates suggest its mass could be somewhere between 21 billion to a staggering 160 billion solar masses, making it one of the most massive black holes ever detected. A dormant giant, Unlike some other supermassive black holes that actively accrete matter and radiate energy, the black hole within NGC 4889 appears to be currently dormant. This means it isn't actively feeding on material, and as a result, there's minimal radiation emanating from its vicinity. The reasons for its dormancy remain a subject of research, but it's believed that past feeding frenzies may have exhausted the available gas in its vicinity. Gravitational influence, the sheer mass of the black hole exerts a powerful gravitational influence on the stars within the galaxy. Studies of the stellar motions and velocities in the galaxy provide crucial insights into the black hole's mass and the gravitational dynamics at play in such massive systems. NGC 4889 and its supermassive black hole provide valuable data points in understanding the formation and evolution of cosmic structures. The presence of such a massive black hole in the galaxy raises questions about the processes that led to its formation and the subsequent evolution of its host galaxy. Continued study, while a significant amount is known about NGC 4889, it remains a vital target for observational astrophysics. Future observations, with even more advanced telescopes, will undoubtedly shed more light on the properties and behaviors of this colossal black hole and its host galaxy. NGC 4889 with its awe-inspiring central black hole, stands as a sentinel in the cosmos, reminding us of the vastness of the universe and the incredible forces that shape it. It is a testimony to the intricate dance of gravity, mass, and light that has been playing out for billions of years across the cosmic stage. Number 2, Ton 618. Within the expansive reaches of space, in the constellation Canes Benatasai, there lies a quasar named Ton 618. This quasar, characterized by its extremely bright nucleus, 
conceals within its heart one of the most massive black holes ever discovered. At its core, Ton 618 is a quasar, which are among the most luminous and energetic objects in the universe. The intense gravitational energy from this process emits radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum, making them observable from vast distances. The black hole inside Ton 618 is truly gargantuan. It's estimated to have a mass of around 66 billion times that of our Sun. To give that some context, it's over 16,000 times the mass of Sagittarius A, the supermassive black hole at the center of our Milky Way galaxy. Due to its immense mass, the black hole in Tun 618 is often categorized as an ultra-massive black hole. Tun 618 is located nearly 10.4 billion light-years away from Earth. The existence of such an ultra-massive black hole raises intriguing questions about the formation and evolution of galaxies and their central black holes. Its sheer mass suggests that black holes can grow to ultra-massive proportions under the right conditions and studying Tun 618 can provide clues about those conditions and processes. Tun 618 stands as a testament to the universe's grandeur and mysteries. Its immense black hole serves as a cosmic beacon, reminding us of the incredible forces and scales that exist beyond our everyday experiences. And finally, the number one black hole in our countdown. Number 1, S50014 plus 81. Residing in the constellation Cepheus, approximately 12 billion light years away from Earth, is the quasar S50014 plus 81. At its core is an awe-inspiring supermassive black hole, one of the most massive and energetic ever detected, making it a celestial wonder of grand proportions. S50014 plus 81, as a quasar, radiates an immense amount of energy, making it one of the brightest objects in the universe. The brightness stems from the intense activity around its central black hole. As matter falls into this black hole, it forms an accretion disk, which heats up due to the tremendous gravitational forces, emitting vast amounts of radiation. The black hole at the center of S50014 plus 81 is mind-bogglingly massive. Current estimations suggest it is around 40 billion times the mass of our Sun. This immense mass categorizes it as an ultra-massive black hole, a term reserved for the true giants of the universe. S50014 plus 81's luminosity is staggering. The energy output from its core is around 3,000 times greater than that of our Milky Way galaxy, even though our galaxy houses billions of stars. The gravitational influence of the black hole doesn't just stop at its immediate vicinity. The energy and radiation it emits can affect vast regions of space, influencing the formation and evolution of nearby galaxies and shaping the cosmic landscape around it. Observing distant objects like S50014 plus 81 provides astronomers and astrophysicists with a unique opportunity. Given the time light takes to travel such vast distances, we are effectively looking billions of years into the past, offering a snapshot of the conditions and processes of the early universe. S50014 plus 81 and its central black hole stand as monumental reminders of the universe's might and majesty. Thank you for joining us on this extraordinary journey, delving into the depths of the universe. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more awe-inspiring content about the wonders of the universe. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe and leave a comment down below saying I subscribed.